right? This new audit that came out says the Department of Public Instruction wasn't adequately measuring whether these programs during the pandemic truly helped kids. And the auditor said the agency is potentially misleading the public about what happened. And I'm going to put the code in there, too. Schools quickly switched to remote learning as the COVID-19 pandemic started. When everyone's lives changed, the federal government sent millions of dollars to North Carolina through the CARES Act to try to help kids as they risked falling behind. In a new report Wednesday, State Auditor Beth Wood says the Department of Public Instruction fell behind on tracking that money. And there are just no measures in place to even measure did the money get spent using every dollar for the right purpose? The key findings, the department spent $31 million to help kids in the summer learning program, but didn't make sure the program was effective for the kids. DPI also spent $37 million on nutrition programs, but again did not have a way to measure the results. The department also did not monitor about $76 million in spending to make sure that money was used appropriately. So to try and do things the way you've always done them, when the crisis arises, does not make sense. DPI declined my request for an interview. In a letter, Superintendent Mark Johnson pushed back on the auditor's report, saying he stands by the spending on meals for kids and blamed the State Board of Education for eliminating a tool to track how well the summer learning program worked. The auditor warned of inaccurate and potentially misleading statements in DPI's response, including that some of DPI's own staff members gave the auditor incorrect information. Most agencies have uh, the good sense to not put a response out like the one you saw because my findings are irrefutable. DPI says it's preparing a report for the General Assembly about this money for them to review. This money from the CARES Act has to be spent by the end of this month.